Here's another image I love to use. This is from the Hubble. It's actually upside down. Did you know that? <laughs> so this is from the Hubble Space Telescope. We're all familiar with those glorious images. It's a very good example of the aura that surrounds us, these invisible fields that are very much color. White light is filled with the colors of the rainbow and the color of the chakra system. They mirror themselves perfectly. Divine intelligence is always giving us the information. It's always here. It's are we calm enough to receive it? And, and we're all capable of that. So as we imagine our form being in the middle here, and, and you can use these, if, if you get different images and want to use this in a different way, please feel free. But for the purposes here, just thinking of our body being in the center, but then our being, our soul, our light, being so much farther out from our body and always intermingling with everything, animate, inanimate objects, so we're just feeling this light, and when we're calm, the whole world feels it, because a really space as we know it is an illusion. <laughs> as crazy as that may seem, I love pondering those sorts of things, but I know it's not everyone's cup of tea. So simply just realizing that we are this radiant light, that my aura standing here is extending very far out. And even as I was preparing for today, I could feel, it felt like there was a lot of energy coming into the room and, and excited about a video like this. Here is a really fun tool I carry around and often I don't even need to say anything if I pull out something like this. Don't believe everything you think. <laughs> yeah. I probably don't need to say another word. Then we might want to question those thoughts and simply let them drift away, just like in meditation, sort of set those aside. We can come back for them later if we need them. We may find that there's some other wonderful thoughts behind them. Once a little six year old actually said to me, The ego sits in front of the heart. And I was stunned. <laughs> it was beautiful. Out of the mouths of babes, listening to children can be very enlightening.